I'm going to show you the uh, Chinese square root algorithm. First, for the square root of something, where's the two digit square root? So, 500 square root of 529. I put a zero before the five because we want to have an even number of digits so we could split them up into these groups of two. Since the square root of five is between two and three, we put a two here. Two squared is four. Subtract and bring down. Now, what we do, and this is a little unusual seeming, we take our answer on top, which is 2, we double it to get 4, and we think 40-something times that same something has to equal 129. Uh, as an approximation, 129 over 40 is 3, so the answer is either going to be 3 or something uh, less than 3. In this case, 3 is the answer, because 43 times 3 is 129. 3 goes there, 43 times 3 goes there, no remainder, 23 is the answer. This works because if I think I have a square, if I have a square that's area 529, if I first pull a 20 by 20 square out of it, that's 400. That's what this was. So what's left is 129, this L-shaped thing. But the L-shaped thing is 20x, if I call this x, 20x, 20x, and x squared. In other words, 40x plus x squared. You see the double of the 2 there? If you factor out the x, it's 40 plus x times x, which is exactly what we had going on over here. For a 3-digit square root, it's the same, uh, same process, but it's a little bit longer. So now I'm taking the square root of 055225, Again, square root of 5 is between 2 and 3. Subtract, bring down again. 40-something times something is close to 152. 152 over 4 is over 40 is still 3. And 43 times 3 is 129 which is as close as I'm going to get to 152. Subtract, bring down the next two digits. Now, don't double the 3, double the 23, so it's now it's 460 blank times blank is equal to 2325. To get an approximation for this, uh, you, can, you can divide 2325 divided by 460, to get something around 5. The answer is either going to be 5 or less than 5. But if you try 5, in this case it actually works out to 2325. So the answer to this question is 235. This works for a similar reason. First we chop off, we, this big square has area 55225. Five, two, five. So first I chop off 200 by 200, which is actually 40,000. And then if I subtract away 40,000 from 55225, we get 15225. That's, that's what this is. That's what the area of this guy has to be. So it's, it's similar. Um, we end up then chopping off 30 from here. And my picture's not, this picture's not done properly, but it's a similar idea. That's how you do a Chinese square root algorithm for two and three digit answers.